Hey guys, it's your girl Adul Sula back again with another YouTube video. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys the trail hike to natural pools that is located in Devil's Cooper. You can look it up on Google and you'll see a whole bunch of pictures and reviews. Please note that the pictures are quite old. They're like one month back. So it's not agreeing right now if you're looking to do this in summertime. So this hike was quite a workout because we took the trail that starts at Guana Bay and not the one from Point Blanche. The one from Point Blanche is less than 30 minutes and the one from Guana Bay is like around 40 minutes. It was longer than the one at Point Blanche and then it also has some sharp turns that could take you over a hill. So you must be in the moment and actually watch where you're stepping because those rocks do not play, the gravel do not play. So for anybody that isn't athletic or isn't steady on their feet, I highly do not recommend this hike for you. If you're willing to try it and that you think that you're good enough for it, then no problem, go ahead. Fun fact about this hike is that it's best to go through from Guana Bay and not the one from Point Blanche because when you pass through SSS Hill and then um, neighborhood, you can get attacked by dogs and stuff like that. So if you want to pass through there, go by car and not walk in. We started this hike around 7 a.m. because we didn't want the sun to be hitting us so hard. It's summertime, y'all already know the sun is not playing. And of course, there's no shade during this hike. Like, there's no trees where you could, like, get some shade. And also, this time around the year, it have a lot of sargas. And the smell is not, is not nice. It's almost unbearable because it is quite toxic for the human beings. And it had a lot of sargas. We did this hike back in June. If you go on Google Chrome or just Google, you will find a whole bunch of reviews on this hike. So you type in Devil's Copper, St. Martin, and then you'll find the trail that leads to the natural pools. Um, the footage is not so good, like, it's, it wasn't the best way to take the hike if you're looking to go and hit a little swim inside a natural pool. But, of course, we wasn't looking to swim, we just come to do the little hike and see how it is. And honestly, I don't think I'll do it back again, <laughs> because, oh my god, like, it was too much. At the end, my legs was giving out, and I didn't have water, and I also had a headache. Um, thank God that I didn't get sunburned, you know, the sun didn't really hit us so hard.
it up or black her and then yeah but otherwise i really love this it was an experience i'm a local samaritan and i never done this hike before so if you're from here and you never did this hike then i highly recommend if you're going to do this hike then good luck be safe and of course
Alright guys, so and then my not hear me though we gotta win hi. But anyways, you make it back safely back at the starting point and I hope you guys love this beautiful video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye!